what is up folks this is Shady Tech in this video I'm going to show you guys how much is the difference between the inner screen which has a 7.6 inch AMOLED screen and the outer screen which has 6.2 inch uh, AMOLED screen as well well the results might just surprise you all right first off I'm going to do some gaming with a uh, Ragnarok which is a rather new game of a one hour of Ragnarok so both of them I set it up to 120 Hz with about 70% of the brightness and let's see how well both of them does right for the first 30 minutes you can see that both the inner screen and outer screen does exactly the same battery and both of them reduce about 10% each at 90% as of 30 minutes of Ragnarok And then after about one hour of playing Runner Rock, you can see that both of them still about the same, just a shade of one percent difference. With the inner screen at seventy nine percent, outer screen is at eighty percent. And I'm moving on to the next test of Instagram for about half an hour. Interestingly, the inner screen does a little bit better for Instagram. Half an hour, it just dropped by 2%, whereas outer screen dropped by 4%. No idea why that's the case, but this, it is how it is at 1 hour and 30 minutes. Because at 1 hour and 30 minutes mark, the inner screen is at 77%, whereas the outer screen is at 76%, which is a little bit lower than the 7.6 inch itself which is kind of interesting and after that I'm moving on to gaming again for another hour of PUBG and this time it's a uh, PUBG as you can see that for the first 30 minutes of PUBG you can see that both of them drop at the same rate at 10% each at in the screen which is at 67% now and out of screen is at 66% of half an hour of PUBG and then right to one hour mark of playing PUBG mobile you can see that both of them once again spot at 10% drop each at 57% and 56% respectively and after that I'm moving on to playing some TikTok videos for about 30 minutes Alright, right after 30 minutes of TikTok, you can see that both of them drop at the same rate at 4% and the inner screen is at 51% and outer screen is at 51% also at this point. So, so as you can see that after 3 hours, both of them spotted at exactly the same percentage at 51% which is really really interesting. And then moving on to the third games I'm going to test which is a Genshin Impact. For the first 30 minutes mark of uh, Genshin Impact, you can see that once again both of them gaming at the same rate at 10, drop of 10% uh, each and the uh, inner screen has a uh, 41% now and the outer screen is at 41% also so both of them spot exactly the same drop in a uh, very percentage Alright moving on to after one hour of Genshin Impact, you can see that inner screen once again dropped just a shy lower than outer screen at just 9% and now it's at 30% and outer screen at 31% doesn't affect that much anyway so I'm moving on to about uh, 30 minutes of YouTube videos and for YouTube videos, we know that it doesn't drop a lot of uh, battery drainage so after 30 minutes of uh, watching YouTube videos, in the screen just drop about 4% and it's at 26% now whereas uh, our screen is about 27% so once again, both of the screen drop exactly at 4% each and after that, I'm moving on to video recording and this time for video recording, I'm doing a 4K at 30 FPS record for about 30 minutes
and after 30 minutes of uh, video recording inner screen drop all the way down to 9% whereas outer screen does a little bit better here at 12% so you can see that there's about 3% uh, difference here once again it's not that much anyway and for the last test just to drain out the battery for the inner screen I'm doing a drainage battery in this mode it literally just turn on everything brightness and uh, all the vibrations and all the settings you can find and just drain it out So about 25 minutes of uh, battery drain test, you can see that in the screen finally gave out at about 5 hours and 25 minutes. At this point, out of screen, which has 6.2 inch, still have 4% uh, left. Just 4%. That's how much different that it makes uh, with the inner screen. Alright, so uh, about 30 minutes of drainage battery, you can see that all the screen still have about 3% left. And just to drain out the battery once again, I'm doing YouTube videos. Still can do about 8 minutes of uh, YouTube videos at about 5 hours 38 minutes. Finally, all the screen reach zero so you can see that there's not much difference between an inner screen and outer screen just a little bit about 15 minutes more <laughs> that's all it takes so for the new technology that uh, samsung made for the inner screen you can see that it's much much more uh, battery efficiency compared to outer screen even though both of them is doing 120 hertz you can see that inner screen is almost if not the same uh, performance wise in battery compared to other screen so so that's it for the battery drain test of both the screen and this shade tech until next video to come see you soon